This has been the biggest party ever staged in England. This is history in the making. And they looked at the majority of Bravers as outcasts in the middle of dirty warehouses or in the middle of fields waving your arms about to loud music. What's that all about? Oh, to be in the Saatchi Gallery is such a fucking contradiction because it's the epitome of what we were bloody against. My name's Tommy Davis and I was accused of driving from John Grove to Land's End in the fastest time ever recorded. We face a growing climate emergency. We have to make important and rapid steps as a planet to fight that emergency. Are we ready? Yeah. Um, you run with? My name's Dave Aspinall, and I'm a documentary filmmaker from a small town in England. You're the most relaxed person I feel with, with the camera. What's happening with the cheese roll this year? Doing it for local tradition for hundreds of yeah. years, yeah. and it all got global over the past few years, and it messed it all up. People are being asked not to stage an unofficial cheese roll at Cooper's Hill tomorrow. Free for the cheese! Yeah. 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 Can't take away what's ours, and they never will. Everyone likes to see themselves in a particular way and I think the selfie has enhanced people's eyes on the way that they envisage themselves. Every great actor uses somewhere, somehow they use some of the methods. Allowing your instinct to work. No one has the freedom that Al has. To Mr. Al Pacino. You should go to classes, acting classes, but just don't listen to what the teacher says. <laughs> I think the cleverest investment is in a sustainable future. It's not about cars and those things you can actually buy. It's not about a bigger house. It's, it's ensuring at the end of it all that, you know, you left the world in a better place. You talk about God's work, but these chains yeah, look okay. very scary. Do I long the They're legs? Their legs. Like okay. This. It's not me, like I said, I'm just an instrument in the hands of the Lord. People have to get over the fact that the Amazon's not an international park. It belongs to Brazil and all the other countries in the basin. So we've just had the first bike turn up. They've tried to make a run for it. This is what they've dropped. I mean, As species become more and more scarce, we need to know ways of putting them back into the forest. We need to start doing it before there's none left. 100% algae sourced crude mineral oil. Whoa! Wow, that's energy! Yeah, I think our generation is very aware of the climate crisis. Every generation has to find a way to deal with the blues. We wouldn't want to be the last generation to die. We're just there. If there wasn't a message or a positive ripple that came out of this and carried on, then what would it be for? <laughs> Should I be concerned? Objectively, these cars are all death traps. If you're driving coast to coast, non-stop, as hard and fast as you can, you're a cannonballer. I think we are more obedient in this country. We trust the rule makers. I've been on my mind for a few years. Like, I miss it. 58 years old to run that hill. Chris, he's going to be our injury, you know that. You have to treat it like a war. And it's an environmental war, and it's eating up the Amazon. We scientists need to be actually out there trying to change things rather than studying the loss and the decline of these oceans that once supported us. Raving is a celebration of life. When you're raving, you're saying, I am alive. Get yeah, enough of that, Daniel. Turn his cider, get it down here. Yeah, really, once you've had about two pints, you know about it. Okay.